I guess that at this point, most of you guys already got your free brand new Beltois PT-01. Let's remember the free card that everyone can actually get just logging in nine days straight into Asphalt 8, which is not hard. Actually, if you play on a daily basis, you, you most of the people already got this card. And today I will be fully upgrading it thanks to an offer where by 10 bucks you could actually get all the kits required to fully upgrade this car, which are around 160 if I'm not wrong. Of course, you also need a lot of uh, class C parts, engines and that stuff. But there I go, I applied the last upgrade into this car and now is the best moment to test this car on multiplayer. I know that I already told you guys that this car would not be a king, mostly because of its main weakness, which is no more and no less than a really really bad uh, triple tap nitro efficiency. I mean, if you use perfect nitro a lot with this car, I can assure you guys that you can actually provide a decent competition for most of the cars at this rank. Because let's remember that at this rank we have the DMC DeLorean Neon Edition, which ha has one of the best nitro efficiencies around this rank. We have also the KTM Expo GTX, which is an extremely good competitor around this rank. And of course, we have the classics, which are the Red Bunny Beast Alpha. We have also the, Ni the Nissan Special Edition and many other cars that actually have way better nitro efficiency than this one. But still, if you know how to manage nitro properly and you try to use triple tap nitro as less as possible, you can actually do fairly well with this car because it has a really good handling, has a fairly decent drift radius and also has a not the best but still a good enough acceleration to not to be knocked down at the beginning of most of the races. I guess that this car uh, acceleration is slightly better than the Ariel Atom and of course will be slightly worse than the KTM Expo GTX. But let's be honest guys, this car is just not worth it. Even if the performance was a bit better, I mean, the performance overall is not bad. But we need to keep in mind that this car costed over 3 million fusion coins in order to be fully upgraded. I mean, by half of the price of fusion coins I just paid in order to fully upgrade this car, I could have fully upgraded the Nissan Special Edition, which is given for free just when you log in with your account on Facebook. And also I could have you know, a fusion coins to fully upgrade the Red Bunny Beast Alpha. So yeah, this car looks insanely cool. I mean, it's so dope the way it looks. It's actually a really nice car to see. But in terms of upgrading cost, it's just not worth it because it's just extremely expensive. And also you don't have that special item that helps you in different festivals to upgrade the car with half the price. So overall, guys, I will not recommend going for this car because despite it looks stunning and has a fairly decent uh, performance, we have cheaper options. We have better options like the DMC DeLorean or we have also the KTM Expo GTX, which goes the same of this car, but still is slightly better. I know that most of you guys can see that you can convert optimal wildcards uh, to this car pro kits on the inventory, but I will not recommend going for it because at the end you will spend a few million credits on getting the kits for a car that is extremely expensive to upgrade and you have no other way uh, to get a cheaper upgrading price because this car is not a festival one. So yeah, I know that many of you guys may be tempted to fully upgrade this car as it's for free and you know, it's not really bad in terms of multiplayer performance, but let's keep in mind that there are cheaper options, there are better options, so maybe going for this car is not the best way to spend your resources because nowadays I know that there are more ways to obtain fusion coins and parts and that stuff, but still you need to save up a lot of stuff in order to fully upgrade this car, which is extremely expensive for the rank where it is. So at this point, I will be asking you guys, which are your thoughts regarding this one based on the races that you are seeing right now? Do you think that this car is worth of your resources? Let me know in the comment section. I will try to read all the comments I can. But for now, that's pretty much everything. I really hope you all enjoyed these races. Let me know your thoughts. As always, drop your like and I will see you really soon with much more Asphalt 8. Will someone look for me if I disappear? No matter how much that I scream, nobody hears. But I see the light from far away, it's down the line Maybe I should not give up without a fight Cause there will be a time oh, oh.
sitting lonely in my room again Acting like I'm innocent Why do I try? Cause now I'm